you know, it's great leadership. He went down for a little bit. I thought he was done, but he came back and finished the game strong. So I'm proud of him. I, I love him as my brother. It seemed like there's one sequence that almost sparked this team. I'm talking about the second game where Barry had on, his, on the edge and then your block mark. And then the, the return by Elijah for the touchdown. It seemed like a couple of bang back plays. Did you guys feel the sense that Mike was on there turning around? Yeah, we thought we had you know, momentum started going our way. But um, we didn't get the scores that we needed to win the game. So at the end of the day, we just got to try to keep making plays and put ourselves in position. It's on us as a whole offensive line. Yeah. Shoulders. It's not anybody else's fault besides us. How uncharacteristic was it to turn guys loose like that? This is hugely uncharacteristic of Boston College. You know that our pedigree is up to line. You know that we that's like what we pride ourselves on. So that's something that really, really is getting at us. What you guys have been taking there? Yeah. Is it kind of a tough thing to deal with? I mean, while I was out, people had to lean on, you know, I had to lean on other people to step up. So, you know, that's just the nature of football. People get hurt. That's what you prepare for. So, you just got to pick up where they left off and keep it moving. One point during the game, I guess, the second half, I saw you kind of trying to get the attention of the offensive lineman. I don't know if you like trying to light them up or what, but what was the message you're trying to convey? You just got to have more pride. You know, I've, I just have to do a lot better job of protecting them. Technical quarterback who's just getting what he started. That's, just, that's what's really hurting right now.